What's up guys, Bronx here. So, I was curious to see how a Devour Hope build would do on Xeno. Typically, Devour Hope is really good on Demogorgon, and their powers are pretty similar with their map traversal, so I thought, let's try that out. You'll see how the game goes, but to my surprise, there was two things I wanted to highlight with this video. Harpoon Gun and Alien Instinct, but mainly Harpoon Gun. This add-on, if you don't know, whenever you exit a tunnel, as long as you can get a hit within 10 seconds after exiting, every survivor that's further than 24 meters from you screams and reveals their location. And this also interrupts whatever they're doing. So this means if they're working on the totem, no matter where they are in the map, as long as it's farther than 24 meters, they will scream and you will know exactly where everyone is. So this will tell you if people are on the totem or if they're not, which is fantastic information. And then once you're able to get the hook, Alien Instinct, if you don't know what this does, it's basically kind of like barbecue. So you hook someone, and then you see the aura of the farthest injured survivor for 5 seconds, and then they also become oblivious for 20. So you can couple this with the tunnels, hook, see the injured survivor, which is going to be a one-shot. You're definitely going to charge crawler mode when you're going through the tunnel, so you have your tail, and you can hopefully get the down quickly, and just chain that into more devour stacks, and then there it is. So, uh, hope you enjoy the game, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Oh, the description is bugged? But the perk works the same. Huh. Interesting. Oh, no one's near my tunnels. Yo, yo, what up? Actually got some good totem spawns, too. Wow, no way on swamp. What? Okay, this is good. So we'll hit her. So this will be some really good um, uh, alien instinct value. Okay, so since she is the only person who's injured, when I hook Ada, we're gonna get to see her aura for five seconds. Like, no matter what. Um, I'll take her here. So, she could realistically be like 10 meters away and I would see her aura. This perk is really good when there's only one person injured. And she's also oblivious right now, too. So she should really have no idea I'm behind her. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, this is good. You mean Rebecca? Wait, what? Oh, did I misspeak? My bad, guys. Yo, show me Rebecca right here. Yeah, yeah. Peace! Oh, that was her. Perfect. Yo, what up? Nice, there's the add-on right there. <laughs> That's actually pretty cool. Yeah, if they're on the totem, then we're... That might save us. Nice, nice, nice. There it is again, okay. Rebecca. Uh, where is she? Hello? Maybe behind a gen? Ah, oh, I can't get too close. Uh, let's go back there. Nope. We leave. It's actually good I didn't, um... Yeah, find her immediately. <laughs> get me. Oh, Ada DC! Wait, what? Why'd she DC, though? The fuck? No, oh, please! It burns! Oh, see, like, look at this value, though. This is sick. She'll keep running, too, it looks like. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Dude, this is the build. This is fucking sick. 
We can just go for Ace, really. In fact, it's probably better I go for this guy. Because I haven't hooked him yet. Yes, sir. I don't know why he doesn't go for the pallet. If he goes for the pallet, he forces a tail attack. This man's not thinking. Okay. It's gonna be Ada. That's the bot. Um. <laughs> oh, they're they're both over there. Ah, oh, homeboy is dead. Hey! Dude, this island's actually sick. You get so much information from this. Okay. This is my first time using this. Uh, harpoon gun. Not too bad. Coastal Reed, welcome back. Uh, thank you for the resub. Yes. Yes. GG. Yes. Okay. I guess we'll take a... Yeah, we should take a look at this. Let's go check the totems. Actually. Really. Why was I seeing Ada's aura? Was that undying right there? I guess it was. Yeah, I had to have been. Okay. Quick! Do they know? I don't know if they know. Uh, does the queen have a different Mori? I don't think so. She has a different uh, lobby animation, though. Wait, where's the totem? Wait, did they get both of them? Oh, why wasn't I seeing this this totem aura? Hello? That was weird. Perfect. Figured this guy was close. I fucking knew it, man. GG. That's my favorite Xeno skin. Uh, it's either the queen or the, um, the the grid one. I don't know. Hard to say because I really do like the default one, but the queen is the queen is really cool. All right, Rebecca. What's it gonna be, Missy? Here she is. Might have to tail attack here. We'll see, though. Uh, I think she's dead with that. Yeah, she's dead. Nice, man. This is a pretty good build. I like, uh, yeah, Alien Instinct was pretty nice. Oh, oops. Um, yeah, I think it synergizes pretty well in the Devour build because, yeah, it just shows you... Shows you the injured survivor, and they become oblivious for 20 seconds. So there's your next easy target. Hey, Bonks, I hope this encourages you to main Alien. What do Alien put on toast? Space Jam Pepe Laugh. Oh my god. <laughs> Manicalo. That's the Manu. Okay, okay. I guess we'll go to this one. Actually, no. How about that one right there? Wow, they spawn right next to my totem. Beautiful. Manicalo. I mean, that guy's right there, but like... I guess we'll just go... 
Might as well focus the uh, the early down. Especially while I have Devour. Nice. I wonder how well she can play this. Like, if you time it right. She slow vaults! What?! That was so random. What? Okay. No, oh, I see your message, Chaos. You going to bed? Mukul Myers is done it. Hello, Games. Hello. Let's go over here. Pop up silently. Uh, what up, Natoya? Welcome back, man. Thank you. Interesting. Wow, what a totem spawn. I've never seen that before. Should've came to this one. Fuck. Here we go. Oh, I thought she kept running. Oh, nice. We actually got the good totem spawn in, in the building. That's that's really good. Oh, we can work with this, though. Oh, yeah. They're removing video filters? No. They're still there. Do I face this guy coming out? Uh, no, I think he was back here. Yeah, here he is. Going for the attack, psych. He runs away. Not so. Could get Shack Window with this. Nice. Man, this guy's unpredictable. Shit. Dude, it's fine. We'll just bloodlust to him. Easy game, boys. Listen to Suicide Boys? I do, yeah. Suicide Boys are one of my favorites. Suicide Boys, Bones, Ghost Mane, and Slipknot. That is my top four. Tried so many tips to uncap. Never get to 120. You don't need to do that anymore. That's just part of the game. There's a setting now. There's an FPS uh, setting. Unless, if you're not getting 120 and you have it set to 120, then your computer just can't... <laughs> it can't get 120. I think that's all it is. Alright, who wants an M1? How about you, Jake? You want an M1, bud? Okay. Teammate? And there was two people here, but I don't know. Burger King or McDonald's? Uh, dude, I've honestly like never really had Burger King. Never had a Whopper before. I'll have two number nines. Number nine, large. Number six, extra dip. No, I'd probably say McDonald's, though. But are Whoppers mid? I feel like Whoppers are overrated. Anyone agree? Whoppers overrated? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I like my number number 15 on the Burger King menu. True. Number 15. Burger King foot lettuce. True though. Dude, look at this information. This purple add-on is is like perfect for this. Dude, it's so nice. If you can manage to get a hit and like get it to work, dude, this could save you. Uh or this could this could save your devour, I mean. On the totem, yep. Where's my thingy? Uh, okay. That's fine. 
Can I get in this damn thing? Oh, I'm on the wrong side. Wait, there it is. <laughs> I'm like, wait, why can't I get in this fucking thing? <laughs> you guys didn't see that. I mean, there's my fifth stack, but like... Hmm. I gotta make sure they don't actually get the totem. No, dude, they're not on this. Bro, if we make it to five stacks and I don't get one down, I'm gonna be so sad. Okay, doesn't look like anyone's on that. What's up, man? GG. Was it worth it, bud? Was it worth it? <laughs> okay, so it is the same boy with the skin. Mookle Myers is done it. Hi, Bronx. Have you decided to become a Xenomorph Mayan? Uh, not yet. Not yet. But I'm having a lot of fun. I mean, just like PTB, so, uh, I mean, yeah, I probably will be. Probably, probably. Let's see. Uh, thank you, by the way. Uh, Nanny, I appreciate it. Welcome back. Here we go. Here we go. What's up, guys? Wait. Oh, I thought they were running in. Whoops. Nice. Oh, definitely not. First P100 Xeno by me? Hell no, there's no way, dude. Dude, especially with TCM being out. TCM is like... I was considering streaming TCM tonight. Over, over this. So, yeah, I don't know, I don't know. Mookle Myers is done it. Pop. Pop. And we got Fang here. Okay, we'll take this. If Ada gets it at this point, so be it. That's fine. Uh, Kev. Welcome back, thank you. Also, Gaiars, 27 months. Thank you guys. Welcome back. Where's that gen? Uh, I don't know where that gen was. Hmm. Oh my god, did you guys see that on the power gauge? Holy shit. Oh, there's hatch behind us. Uh, here, let's just go close it. No reason to risk it. Now we can kill Ada. Oh, I see. Oh. Huh. What do the turrets do? So when they burn you, if they burn you for long enough, they can pull you out of your power like this? So you can't use the tail. They also can act as a, a detection because they beep when Xenomorph is close. But yeah, they pull you out of the crawl mode so you can't use your tail. Four devour kills, baby. Let's go. Dead. 